An antipendium from Latin ante and pendere, to hang before. Place, antipendia, also known as a paramount or hanging, or, when speaking specifically of the hanging for the altar, an altar frontal Latin, pallium altaris, is a decorative piece, usually of textile, but also metalwork, stone or other material that can adorn a Christian altar. Specifically, and as the etymology of the word suggests, an antipendium hangs down in front of whatever it covers, and is to be distinguished from the altar linens which are used in the service of the Eucharist, and an altar cloth which covers the top of the altar table mensa. Topic. Types of antipendia Topic. Topic. Western Christianity. Topic. Antipendium is the word used for elaborate fixed altar frontals, which, in large churches and especially in the Ottonian art of the early medieval period, were sometimes of gold studded with gems, enamels and ivories, and in other periods and churches often carved stone, painted wood panel, stucco, or other materials, such as azulejo tiling in Portugal. When the front of an altar is elaborately carved or painted, the additional cloth altar frontal normally reaches down only a few inches from the top of the altar table, this is called a frontlet. In other cases it may reach to the floor, the frontal, properly so called. In both situations, it will usually cover the entire width of the altar. A Jacobean frontal will cover the entire altar, reaching down to the floor on all four sides. The Anglican canons of 1603 order that the Lord's table should be covered, in time of divine service, with a carpet of silk or other decent stuff, thought meet by the ordinary of the place. Can. 82. Covers for lecterns and pulpits are generally similar to a frontlet, normally covering the desk of the lectern or pulpit and handing down about a foot or longer in front, visible from the congregation. Topic. Eastern Christianity. In the Orthodox Church, the holy table altar may be covered with one or two coverings. There is always an outer frontal, covering the top of the holy table and hanging down several inches on all four sides. This kind is used alone if the front of the holy table is elaborately carved or decorated. For a fully vested holy table, a second, inner hanging is used. This covers the holy table fully on the top and hangs down to the floor on all four sides. The analogia icon stands are covered with a covering known as a proskinitarian. As with the coverings used on the holy table, there may, again, be only one outer covering or also a second, inner covering that hangs to the floor though, in this case, sometimes only in the front and back. Topic. Construction Topic. A cloth antipendium is normally of the same color and often of the same fabric and similar style as the vestments worn by the clergy. The fabric may vary from very simple material, such as cotton or wool, to exquisitely wrought damasks, fine watermarked silk, velvet, or satin. Embellishment is commonly by means of decorative bands of material called orphreys, embroidery sometimes in gold or silver thread, or making use of pearls and semi-precious stones or appliques, fringes and tassels, all of a complementary color to the fabric. The most frequently used symbol on both vestments and hangings is the cross. The antipendium is normally lined in satin, using a matching hue. Topic. Colors. Topic. The colors used tend to be suggested by the liturgical tradition of each denomination. Most Western Christian churches that observe a developed liturgical tradition use white, gold, red, green, violet and black, with each being used on specified occasions. A rose color may be employed for the fourth Sunday in Lent and the third Sunday in Advent. In Anglican circles, blue is sometimes prescribed for feasts of the Blessed Virgin Mary see liturgical colors, although it is also used, and officially, in some areas of the Roman Catholic Church. Among Eastern Christians, there tend to be two types of vestments, somber dark ones and festal bright ones. Beyond that, no specific colors are officially required. Among groups such as the Russian Orthodox Church, a pattern of fixed colors has developed, somewhat similar to that used in the West, although they are not, strictly speaking, required. 
Topic: Other usages. Topic: Antipendium can also be used to describe the front of the altar itself, especially if it is elaborately carved or gilded. The famous Paula di Oro in St. Mark's Basilica in Venice originated as an antipendium, although it is used as a reardos now. See also Topic Altar cloth Liturgical colors Topic References Topic Topic External Links Topic Altar frontal article from the Catholic Encyclopedia Orthodox altar with red frontal Jacobean frontal street. John's Church, Edinburgh, Scotland.